The reason we became more sustainable and environmentally aware is because we want to leave things in a better position than when we arrived. We see the problems with climate change, global warming, pollution, and we wanted to do something that would affect that as well. I think the biggest challenge to making your life more sustainable is that we are more and more reliant on electrical equipment in the home and it's very difficult to go back. We want an easier way of living and so balancing that with sustainability is the most difficult thing. Over the years we've tried to improve our carbon footprint. We do all the obvious things uh, in the house like recycling, turning off lights, no standby switches left on, only using hot water that we actually need, not wasting it. We improved our insulation. It's over a foot thick in the roof of the house. We have insulation in the floors and we try and think energy all the time. We have a smart meter in the house. And in the last five years, we've uh, made big strides to um, conserve energy um, and to produce our own energy um, by including adding in a wind turbine and solar panels. Outside we have planted trees and as we harvest the wood we have to cut it and stack it and we dry it for at least two years so that it's uh, safe to burn in the house. We have animals and we grow most of our own vegetables. The way we live is a very healthy way of living. Uh, we produce our own food um, and we have a, a great abundance of fresh fruit and vegetables. We certainly get our five a day in. Um, it's been wonderful to bring our children out to see where their food comes from. Uh, it doesn't just come off a supermarket shelf. I milk the goats in the morning, every morning, and it's all we drink, which saves so much on, on cost of buying the milk. The Future Friendly Award is a very good way of showing how you can live sustainably and it would be lovely to be recognised for the way we've been living. Our lifestyle has been like this for 28 years. We gradually built up additional things but we're just ordinary people trying to do things that uh, are not harming the environment.